All right, thanks so much, Carson. Happening today, we'll get a better idea on how the pandemic is affecting our kids in the classroom. Way 31's Luke Hindas joining us live right now with what that new data being released today might show. Hey, Luke. Chris, Megan, for the first time since the pandemic began, we are going to get a look at the nation's report card and see how Alabama is faring since the pandemic began. And we're talking pretty specifically here about fourth and eighth graders when it comes to their math scores and their reading scores. Now, this all comes after some other data we got over the summer that shows Huntsville may not be up to par. It shows that about 25 percent of fourth graders right here in the Rocket City are not reading at the level they should be. So today we're going to get some new data and compare the two and see how statewide Alabamians and here in Madison County those students are faring. Now, to try and get these scores up, state lawmakers, they've got a plan. They've created the Alabama Literacy Act. It all goes into effect next school year, the 2023-2024 school year. So today's data, the data we get today, will be some of the last we see before that Literacy Act goes into effect to try and boost these reading scores across the state of Alabama. Now, that data is going to be released a little bit later this morning at 10 o'clock, just a few hours from now, because it is statewide. That update is happening down in Montgomery. Reporting live this morning, Luke Hyde-Ash, Way 31 News.